Today, the universe is like a stormy sea, roaring with warning about a looming danger that might strike under the cover of night. If you wish to steer clear of this ominous fate, heed my plea and journey with me through these words to the very end. Amen. Whispers in the air suggest that this danger creeps from the shadows, manipulated by sinister forces. If you seek truth and yearn to shield yourself from the grasp of uncertainty, grasp onto each word that follows like a lifeline, with unwavering focus and grave intent. God's voice echoes like a distant thunder, warning that a cherished soul might depart from our midst, perhaps even as the sun sets today. I beseech you to hold this message close, for it carries weighty significance. Brace yourself for the arrival of sorrow's unwelcome embrace, as envy slithers like a shadow, seeking to poison your spirit. Yet, with unwavering determination and resilience akin to a mighty oak standing firm against the wind, you can triumph over these trials. The angels, like vigilant sentinels, fret over the venomous whispers swirling around your name. To shield yourself from the looming storm of repercussions, safeguard your secrets as tenderly as you would cradle a fragile bloom in the midst of a tempest. Like a beacon in the night sky, it's urged that you nurture your dreams, hold on to them tightly, and trust in a God whose power knows no bounds. Let your determination burn bright like a guiding star, leading you towards your aspirations, for God has promised unexpected blessings and progress on this very day. As the sun sets, painting the sky with hues of gold and pink, bid farewell to the day with a heart brimming with joy, knowing that divine opportunities await those who heed the call from above. In moments when doubt threatens to overshadow your spirit, the angels stand ready to lend you their strength. But remember, it's essential to fortify your bond with the divine, like roots anchoring a mighty tree, drawing sustenance from the earth. Reply with 2626 to receive a heartfelt prayer and unlock the blessings meant for you. God's gentle whisper carries a solemn warning. Danger lurks on the horizon, like dark clouds gathering before a tempest. This message serves as a guiding light in the midst of looming shadows, urging you to keep your faith unwavering, to lend your ears to wisdom, and to stand firm against the seductive allure of temptation. The angels, with their watchful eyes, sense the presence of a sinister force hovering nearby, like a silent predator stalking its prey. Listen to the words woven into this message until the very last syllable, and with each share, we've a protective shield to thwart the schemes plotted against you. Respond with 3434 to receive a shield of protection against the shadows that seek to cast their darkness upon you. God extends a promise of abundance and prosperity akin to a shimmering oasis in the vast desert of uncertainty for those who choose to walk in his footsteps. Like a gentle breeze that whispers hope into the ears of the weary, the angels assure us that the storms of adversity shall soon give way to the gentle caress of tranquility. If only you pledge your unwavering support to this message, clinging to it like a lifeline in the tempest. Prepare to be enveloped in the warm embrace of consecration where blessings, akin to precious jewels, shall rain down upon you, particularly in the realm of finances, like a cascade of golden coins descending from the heavens above. God's power knows no bounds, capable of turning the impossible into reality. But to witness this divine miracle, you must surrender yourself completely, allowing His words to permeate your very soul and lift you to heights you never thought possible. Even when all seems lost, Remember that God stands ready to rescue you from the depths of despair. Like a radiant shield, the angels promise you round-the-clock protection, rendering you impervious to harm. Picture yourself standing amidst a battlefield, where a thousand may fall to your side and ten thousand to your right, yet you remain untouched, a beacon of divine protection amidst the chaos. Leave a comment with the number 3333 and watch as your burdens magically lift vanishing like morning mist. The angels urge you to be not just a dreamer, but a force to be reckoned with, fueled by unwavering faith and unyielding determination. Picture yourself not just chasing dreams, but outrunning them, achieving success and victory at every turn. God's grand design is unfolding, a wondrous event set to unfold before the 5th of December, promising a financial windfall that could reshape your destiny. 
but beware, for dark shadows lurk, seeking to cloud your thoughts and disturb your peace. Within this message lies an epic clash of forces, a spiritual battleground where angels wage war against darkness. If you wish to see the angels emerge victorious, show your support by tapping that like button and whispering a heartfelt Amen. But beware, for there is a lurking danger, the return of an envious soul into your life, a threat not to be underestimated. Yet fear not, for God promises to be your unwavering support, lifting you from any fall. So let your faith be your guiding light, not mere luck, which offers fleeting pleasures but fades like shadows at dawn. God envisions a joyous woman walking alongside you, but advises caution once her identity is revealed to prevent future heartaches from misguided choices. Leave a six to claim a slice of today's blessings and forge a path that outshines the past. Keep moving forward, eyes fixed ahead, for God has a treasure trove of wonders awaiting your journey. The angels hint at the dawn of a new month, promising radiant days ahead if you let the hope of God illuminate your soul. Do not despair, for a shower of financial blessings is on its way to your life. God always has an ear for your prayers, and the more you put your trust in His promises, the brighter your days will shine. It's wise to step back from relationships that offer no reciprocity. Beware, for the enemy may try to knock you down within the next six hours, so stand firm and brace yourself against future sorrows. The angels paint a picture of abundance on your horizon promising a year's end filled with more joy than ever before. Wealth beyond measure will grace your doorstep without resorting to shortcuts for quick gains. Drop a comment with 8,888 to declare that the seeds of financial miracles are sprouting in your life. If you embrace this message with faith, God has an exciting surprise waiting for you at the end of the journey, but it's yours only if you're willing to accept it. Move forward quietly, letting your actions speak louder than words, and confide only in God to keep the enemy from twisting your words against you. Though we all stumble and fall, genuine repentance before God opens the door to forgiveness. You're not alone in this journey, so let out an amen to show your trust. The angels are now on alert, guarding against the negative energy trying to sneak into your life. They urge you to journey to the end of this message to unlock freedom and tranquility within yourself. Drop a comment with 5,656 to spread positivity and break free from negative cycles. God cautions that today marks the final stretch of the month, so brace yourself for what's to come before the year wraps up. Be vigilant, for the enemy may strike today. This urgent message serves as a beacon a warning that could profoundly impact someone dear to your heart within your family. God sounds the alarm about an imminent peril looming on the horizon, one that could jeopardize your very existence by the end of November. Pay heed to every word, for this information holds the key to your safety and well-being. Type 3535 to unlock doors of opportunity and blessings throughout December. This is about your journey and the path to becoming a better version of yourself. God pledges to supply all your needs. Your role is to welcome it. He walks beside you, weaving a tapestry of renewal to soothe your soul in moments of sorrow. Simply repent for your wrongdoings and open your heart wide. The angels emphasize the importance of your presence at the conclusion of this message. Therein lies a revelation that could sway your thoughts and shatter trust. Understand the outcomes that may follow. They caution against relying solely on one income source. Aim to gather around you sincere and faithful companions who journey forward alongside you. God cautions that today, the enemy may seek to confine you, obstructing your path through this month. Join me in repeating, Lord, I surrender to you. Stand beside me, be my guiding light, and let your words mend my wounds. Amen. The angels catch a glimpse of a somber possibility where a family member may face adversity. To steer clear of this fate, pay heed to every moment of this message. God heralds the unveiling of a fresh opportunity in your life, leading to a remarkable achievement in the initial week of the upcoming month. The deeper your trust in His Word, the sturdier and more flourishing you shall grow. The angels caution that overlooking this message will prove to be an error laden with repercussions. 
Drop a comment with 9292 to beseech the fulfillment of all financial miracles and for restoration. God is about to unveil a hidden truth, but urges you to guard it closely, for there may be unseen eyes tracing your steps in the digital realm. Stay vigilant and spread this message to others, for divine intervention awaits. God pledges a magnificent financial blessing within the next 12 hours of November. However, be wary, for the adversary seeks to lead you astray. Yet, by heeding every word of this message, you shall find yourself rejuvenated and fortified against temptation. Leave a comment with the number 5959 to request the downfall of the enemy's wicked schemes and to invoke the radiant light of God upon you. God will sweep away deceitful companionships and schemes. Hold on to hope and stay with us until the end. Remember, the enemy thrives on spreading sorrow and discord among your peers, but by embracing the teachings of God, you can make a profound difference. God will draw positive energy towards you shielding your dreams from the shadows of despair. The angels stress the significance of cherishing your inner calmness, as it's the key to unlocking both financial success and a tranquil existence. They pledge to guide you through obstacles and unveil hidden truths. Hit the like button and stick around till the very end to uncover the opportunities that await. God wishes to warn you that a young member of your family might face an untimely departure. By listening to this message until the very end and showing your support by liking it, you could potentially save their precious life. Let your action be a beacon of hope and trust in the Divine Presence. Leave a comment with the number 7171 to demonstrate your faith in God's protection and to break free from negative cycles in your life. God has tirelessly labored to rescue you, recognizing your inherent value and longing for your well-being. If you persevere until the very end, God pledges to grant you health, peace, and wisdom to confront any challenges that may arise. The encroaching darkness will no longer cast its shadow upon you, for you shall radiate as a beacon of light along your path, guided by divine words. The angels urge you to engage in daily prayer for your safety, liberating yourself from the snares and delusions that may lead you astray. Stay close and shielded, seeking protection from all that may harm you. Comment 92 to call upon the divine to cast down all negativity afflicting your faith, allowing you to emerge as a renewed individual, overflowing with unwavering faith, and reclaiming twice what was lost, including your dreams. God vows to orchestrate the arrival of the perfect companion into your life precisely when the time is right, infusing your days with boundless happiness, joy, and abundance. This message serves as a beacon of hope and trust, assuring you that God has meticulously designed a flawless plan for your life. Embrace this divine promise, for through unwavering belief in God and His divine plan, you can embark on a journey of transformation where the Lord illuminates your path to a brighter tomorrow. God is stepping into your life, ready to metamorphose your sorrows into waves of joy and your financial struggles into rivers of abundance. Affirm your belief in these promises by writing 111, for with His boundless wisdom, God can swiftly revolutionize your existence if you surrender to Him. Invite God to intervene and witness miracles unfolding before your eyes in the blink of an eye. Pray with humility and gratitude, acknowledging the constant outpouring of God's love and care in your life. Rest assured, your brightest days are yet to unfold, with thrilling news, unexpected miracles, and even grander blessings poised to grace your path. Write 110 to claim these promises and share this message with those in need. Jesus beckons you to seek solace in Him, even amidst life's storms, for the Word of God endures eternally. Let your heart resonate with an Amen to affirm your unwavering trust in these divine words. God comprehends that people may falter in their support, but his steadfast love remains unwavering. He implores you to entrust your life into his capable hands, for even in the wake of mistakes, God's love will guide you towards a new dawn brimming with opportunities. Write 22 to profess your faith, as God pledges to fortify your weaknesses, heal your wounds, and reignite the flames of peace and love within your heart. Embrace Jesus as your Lord with unyielding conviction, 
allowing the God of hope to infuse your life with boundless joy, peace, and unwavering faith, illuminating your path with radiant hope wherever you tread. God whispers words of solace, assuring you that despite enduring suffering and shedding tears, He will shower you with blessings, restoration, and exaltation before your adversaries. In earnest prayer, beseech the Lord, the infinite embodiment of mercy and love, to unveil His light and wisdom over every word and intention expressed in this text. May the divine grace of God protect and guide all who tread the path of righteousness, dispersing darkness to usher forth an abundance of light, happiness, and prosperity for all who walk hand in hand with the Lord. With unwavering faith, petition God to vanquish all evil and danger, granting wisdom and blessings to those who seek His ways. May divine grace illuminate every home, fostering peace and harmony, and may the promised blessings and miracles manifest in the lives of all who receive this message with open hearts. God stands as your fortress and closest companion, where treasures beyond human imagination await. Brace yourself, for a cascade of blessings is poised to descend upon you. The time has arrived for you to achieve remarkable feats. Share in the comments how God watches over and nurtures your family, serving as the beacon of unity among you. Picture God as a vigilant commander, safeguarding and guiding your every step. Take heart, for wondrous things are about to unfold, marking a new chapter in your life. Amen. Keep your faith in God's boundless power alive, for He can accomplish marvels beyond your wildest dreams. Stand resolute in your faith as significant moments draw near, maintaining hope and courage to receive the blessings God has in store for you. Dear child, let me speak candidly with you. I understand the weight of worries, problems, fears, and doubts that can overwhelm us at times. But know this, you are never alone in these trials. I, your God, am always by your side. Today, I invite you to release all your concerns into God's capable hands. He possesses the strength to fortify us, the wisdom to guide us, and the clarity to illuminate every corner of our lives. Place your trust in Him, believing that tomorrow holds extraordinary possibilities. God is fashioning something extraordinary just for you, something that will lift the burdens weighing on your heart. Feel the comforting presence of the angels surrounding you, offering solace and support in your journey. It is not a time for ease, but for standing up in spiritual warfare. Challenges press in, and the enemy seeks vainly, yes vainly, to disrupt the plans I have laid out for your life. It's a battleground, but fear not, you are not alone. Arm yourself from the armory of the heavens, the armory of my promises, and the empowerment of my spirit. My word is your weapon. Speak it boldly, a declaration of victory against the forces that oppose you. Don't be timid. Open your mouth and let my words be the sword that cuts through doubt and negativity. Don't hold back. Think of yourself as fully equipped. You are not naked. You are clothed in my protection, surrounded by my angels who stand ready to assist you. Claim this land of your life, your dreams, and your goals. Don't allow the enemy to steal what is rightfully yours. Now is the hour to press forward. Let your prayers be your battle cry, your spoken words, the weapons that push back the darkness. Don't wait for victory to appear. Take hold of it through your unwavering faith and the strength I provide. With each word of faith spoken and each declaration of my promises, I will turn back the shadows, replacing them with the tangible evidence of your triumphs. As you continue in the battle, remember that the power of your words goes beyond your immediate circumstances. According to the scriptures, your words can shape your reality and create a future filled with hope and promise. Speak life into your situation, speak blessings over yourself and others, and watch as the atmosphere around you shifts. In the midst of the fight, don't forget to lean on the support of those around you that I've placed in your life to hold up your hands and strengthen you by their faith. Faith for your situation, faith for victory, and that right suddenly. Seek them out and surround yourself with people who speak life into you, who encourage you in your journey, and who remind you of the promises I have spoken over your life. 
Together, you can stand strong against the attacks of the enemy. Ultimately, this battle is not just about overcoming temporary obstacles. It's about positioning yourself to walk in the fullness of my plans and purposes for your life. So take up your weapon of choice, your words of faith, and declare victory over every obstacle standing in your way. The battle may be fierce, but remember, you are not alone. The Father is with you, leading you to triumph in every situation. This is where it gets interesting. For all the provocations of the enemy in your life, I will turn them back and establish you in blessing and my favor. When the enemy comes to his end, he roars ever so loudly. The darkness before the dawn is the last gasp of the enemy of your soul, vainly hoping that his strategy to destroy you will fail. Set your eyes upon me. Commend your path to my hand. Refuse to allow yourself to respond emotionally to the bleakness of the natural circumstance. This is but a light affliction that will burn away as I arise as the day star in your life to illuminate the favored position you have been in all along. If you could look from the perspective of mere months from now upon the stage challenge, there would be a smile on your face. Refuse to borrow trouble. Refuse to be sorrowful or in fear of your future. I am the god of impossible situations and I am coming through for you. Set yourself to be faith-filled and faithful to the call wherewith I have called you. Allow the heat of the furnace to burn away everything in your character that conflicts with my love and my purity. I am a fire from my waist upwards and my waist downward. I am the refining fire that purges away the dross of sin and sinful tendencies. At the end of the matter, not only will you come forth victorious, but you will come forth shining with my character and holiness, having usurped everything in your person reflecting my glory. The Father says today, timidity and fear are going in boldness, audacity, and faith unfeigned are calling you up into a place of perfect love, because love never fails, thus you will not fail. You see, perfect love casts out all fear, my beloved. Through the work of the cross, I have brought perfect love into every aspect of your life. It is through this perfect love that I am perfecting what you have committed to me. Relinquish any expectations in your heart that go against my promises. Trust me, for I am leading you towards the fulfillment of your highest heart's desires and dreams. I haven't said no, and I have not excluded you, nor have I denied you. Make it your now determination to free yourself from the chains of unfounded fear and deny its hold on your life. The past accomplishments I have brought forth in your life are merely the beginning of a season of great fruitfulness. Are you ready to experience a catch so abundant that the nets cannot contain? Are you ready for your words and actions to carry the same power as if I spoke and acted? You are standing on the threshold of a new entitlement, a new experience of the blessings that flow from the cross. These entitlements are manifesting themselves in your healing, your spiritual well-being, your relationships, and even in your finances. Embrace this season, step up boldly, and indulge in the richness of life. I have sent forth my blessings, my worthy portion, and they are meant for you to receive. Have faith, for by spending your faith, you are investing in the currency of the kingdom, a currency that surpasses anything earthly means can offer. Remember, I am with you always, and I will never leave you nor forsake you. This is a time of blessings, my child. Embrace it fully, for it belongs to you. Trust in me, for I am faithful to bring all that I have promised to pass in your life. The Father says today, from the place of renewed intimacy and experience of my glory, is coming to your life a beautiful transformation, like a spinning dance of growth and discovery. My word is coming to a place of amplification in your spirit, even as Adam and Eve experienced my following, when they heard my voice walking in the cool of the day. I am walking in the garden of your inner man, that you might find me and seek me and step into a new profound level of relationship that is yours to know and enjoy by my determinate will. There is a sound, a resonance of my sound and my voice that will begin to permeate your life. In your study of the scriptures, you will come across the passage where they heard my voice walking in the cool of the day. Even so, I am walking by my word and my voice in the inner man of your spirit that I've created as my dwelling place. So dig deeper, 
so you can understand this as the sound of my wind and my word whirling on the breezes of your inner man. I have instilled within you a spirit that resonates, much like a tuning fork. At this pivotal point in your life, I choose to step closer to you and pluck the strings of your inner man so that my sound, my voice and my song will come forth, be known and set many free with the freedom wherewith this day I make you free. As a result, you will hear my sound and, in turn, emit my sound, and the effects of miracles and answered prayer will be tangible. Just as certain sounds can shatter glass or evoke physical reactions, you will shed burdens that have clung to you, causing remarkable transformations in your presence. Prepare yourself, my beloved child, for when you enter a room, people will take notice. There may even be instances where someone, seemingly put together, but secretly struggling with a demonic stronghold, will undergo a physical reaction that draws attention from everyone around. Recognize this as an opportunity, for demons are like unruly children seeking attention. With a simple command from you, shut up and come out, you will demonstrate my divine power. My hand is ready to manifest in your life in a unique and powerful way. Do not be surprised if these extraordinary encounters occur outside of traditional church settings. They may arise as you go about your everyday activities, simply being yourself. An angel of change will accompany you, initiating transformations in those around you, and you will carry the radiance of my glory, where in the past was nothing but disappointment and failure. The Father says today, I am doing a complete work in your past, present and future. My spirit is actively working in your past, bringing liberty and healing to every broken area of your life from the fractures and abuses of the past. You felt insecure and unsafe, even in your skin, and I've seen that, says God. I understand the need for emotional security, so be assured that I am concerned and moving with the gentle hand of a shepherd, resolving the conflicts, stilling the nightmares and threats of the enemy, that have touched every aspect of your being, your heart, mind, and trust. You are safe, says God in my hands. You are safe and secure. When you feel panic and anxiety taking over, say this to yourself, I am safe. I am secure in my Father's capable hands. The enemy, the circumstance, and the situation may churn and boil around you to the point all seems lost, but beloved, be assured that nothing and no one can pluck you out of my loving care. Your life is hidden in me, protected and shielded from the challenges and uncertainties of the world. So much so, that the enemy is blinded like those who grope to find the door when the angels visited Lot in Sodom. They are seeking to gain access, but I have blinded their ambitions and turned them instead against each other so that you won't have to fight them, but witness their removal from your life by their misguided efforts. The Father says, time for you to soar, time for you to fly, like a bird in flight, encapsulated in a bubble of my presence, love, peace, and faithfulness. You are ascending in worship that you might descend in warfare, witnessing the enemy's total defeat in every area of your life. People, forgive them. Forgive, release, bless, move on. Even though people may disappoint you at times, you can rest assured that you will not be shaken because your trust is firmly placed in that Christ anointing, my indwelling presence on the inside of you. Be confident and be assured, says the Father. You will rest deeply and live confidently, knowing that my embrace and protection encompass every part of your life. This is your season to experience the freedom that comes from finding your identity in me. As you continue your journey, Remember the truth of my promises. Doubt your doubts and embrace my sure word that has gone out over you but the prophets. Embrace healing, restoration and security, knowing you are anchored in my unwavering love. Your past does not define you. It becomes a testimony of the redemptive initiative of grace and power that is flowing down to you from my throne and filling you with those things necessary to reshape your entire existence. Walk confidently and joyfully this day and every day going forward, knowing that your life is hidden in me and that I will never fail you. The Father says today, let your mouth pray. 
put more energy into prayer than you do all the vain, unenlightened tactics of the flesh that only make matters worse in your life. I say again, let your mouth pray. E embrace the power of prayer. Every word you utter in prayer is valuable and holds significance in the eyes of the divine. Allow your mouth to be a vessel of prayer, for it is through prayer that you align your desires with my will and desires. When you pray, your words ascend as fragrant incense before the throne of the Almighty, establishing an atmosphere of connection. Never underestimate the profound effect your prayers can have. The enemy may attempt to downplay prayer as an act of desperation, but I assure you, it is a transformative catalyst in your life. Through prayer, you can transcend the ordinary and step into the realm of the miraculous. Let your mouth utter prayers with passion and conviction and watch as mountains crumble and barriers tremble before you. No challenge or obstacle in your life is too insurmountable for the fervent prayers offered at the altar of your faith. Prayer has the power to turn my promises into tangible results and over the top outcomes in your life. The angels assigned to you from the moment of your birth eagerly listen for your prayers, ready to bring them before my throne with anticipation. Don't let a lack of prayerfulness Leave your assigned angel standing empty-handed before God. Know that I am always ready and willing to hear your prayers. I am inclined and disposed to answer you. My default response to your pleas is a resounding yes, always yes, and amen. There is no obstacle too great that leaves me unwilling to overcome it in order to meet your needs. The cross of Calvary stands as a testament to the lengths I am willing to go to help you in your moments of greatest desperation. Let your words of connection and surrender to my spirit bring about the transformation, miracles and breakthroughs you seek. Your breath in prayer is never wasted. It is a divine invitation for me to show up and work wonders in your life. Trust in my faithfulness and unwavering love as you engage fervently in sacred act of prayer. The Father says today, Step into the perfection wherewith I am perfect. And as I am, so are you in the earth. Who told you that no one is perfect? Was that a thought from me? Was it a God-breathed inspiration? No, it was not. When I said in my word, Be perfect as your Father in heaven is perfect, I released all the grace and power you need to see it done in your life. It is not up to you in your own efforts or ability. I am the Father inside you doing the work to bring you forth in my image, with my character and my perfection intact as your personal testimony. When the enemy of your soul tears you down and demeans your prospects, hold my word up as the shield for your faith. When life, circumstance or other people trash your dreams and visions, make up your mind then and there that you will believe the good report. All things are possible. I am the God living inside you for whom nothing is impossible. That is who I am, therefore in me, that is who you are. You are the earthly reflection of my heavenly image. You are the image bearer of the invisibility of my glory. Yield to that glory. Embrace that glory. Wrap your faith around that glory and see my perfection become your manifest portion in life. So walk in my perfection and express my perfection even in the midst of your blatant and obvious imperfections. Know who you are. Receive my love. Abide in me daily. Walk in faith and embrace the risks by which mountains are moved and destiny realized. Obey me in all things even when you don't understand or for that matter, agree. Be transparent and honest for as it has been said, I am more interested in relationship than I am in respect. When you walk in my perfection, you will experience a life of joy, peace and fulfillment. You will be a blessing to others and make a difference in the world. So today, my beloved child, choose to walk in my perfection. It is your destiny. The Father says today, my spirit is moving in your situation to shed light on the deceptions that the enemy has sought to weave into your life. I am bringing forth in glaring illumination the secrets that have been hidden in darkness and ensuring that they are proclaimed loudly, resonating from the very depths of your being. The enemy's strategy is to entangle you in disappointment and overwhelm you with frustration. 
However, I implore you to redirect your focus away from people and circumstances, fixing your gaze firmly upon me, your loving father. It is inevitable that people will let you down and situations may bring forth frustration. But I urge you not to place your trust solely in human strength. Instead, trust in the word that I have planted deep within your heart. My love for you is unwavering. I will never forsake you or disregard your pleas for help. My beloved child, do you truly trust me? If you do, then allow me to step in and take control of every aspect of your life. I will guide you from where you currently are to a place of victory and abundant blessings. The promises I have made in your life are the very catalyst for the breakthrough you yearn for. In this journey, it is crucial that you do not invest your energy or initiative into anything or anyone that contradicts the promises I have spoken over your life. The enemy seeks to isolate you, to cut you off from the vital resources that will lead you on the path to breakthrough. Therefore, I encourage you, dear one, to test the spirits around you. True discernment is not fueled by suspicion or doubt, masked as religious behavior. Rather, it is rooted in love, which casts out all fear. It is a perfect love that is unconditional and brings rest to your weary soul. Enter into the rest that I have lovingly prepared for you. As part of this process, it is important to forgive those whom you hold anger against. Release those you have unjustly judged in your thoughts. Remember, dear one, that all humanity is prone to evil and wickedness can manifest in every action. However, I offer you cleansing and redemption at the foot of the cross. There, I will set you free and bring you to a place of renewed and vibrant purification. Let go of the need to be right and release the demand for justice that does not align with the principles of my kingdom. Surrender these burdens to me and I will bear them for you. I am here for you ready to expose the deceptions of the enemy and lead you into a life of victory and blessings. Trust in me, lean on me and allow me to guide you through every step of your journey. Embrace the rest and freedom that come from forgiving others and surrendering your burdens at the cross. Together, we will overcome the enemy's schemes and walk in the fullness of the life I have prepared for you. The Father says today, I know your heart and I understand the anxiety and fear you are feeling about the uncertainty of the future. Know that because you live in a fallen environment, the spirit of Leviathan swims through the waters of prideful fallen humanity all around you, and you will face challenges and obstacles that may seem insurmountable. However, I want to assure you that your tomorrows are in good hands. As the sovereign God of the universe, I fully control everything, including your life. Nothing taking place in your life is beyond my reach or my power to address. Shift and bring deliverance. Trust me. Cry out to me. Let your mouth pray. Even though you may not be able to see it now, I have a good plan for your future. I am a God of abundance and life and want to give you the best. Encourage your heart. Lift your head up. Set your expectations high. Dream big and believe that I can do anything. When your hopes are dashed and distractions surround you, turn to my word. It serves as a template for your life, providing guidance and wisdom. Meditate on my word and let it shape your expectations for the future. Remember, this is a time for action, not just waiting. I have already equipped you with everything you need to succeed. Now, it is up to you to take action and put my word into practice. Through your faith and belief in me, you will witness amazing results. I am no respecter of persons. What I have done for others, I can certainly do for you. There is no need to hesitate in believing that I can do great things in your life. Trust in my power and my love for you, and you will see remarkable transformations. So, as you face uncertainty or obstacles, remember that I am in control. Trust in my plan. Set your expectations high and take action guided by my word. Your future is bright, and with my guidance, you will overcome any challenges that come your way. The Father says today, I am with you. I am in you. I am all around you, surrounding you with my favor, love, protection, and guidance in times of difficulty. I know that you are facing many challenges. 
Your life, family situation, and other aspects of life are full of turmoil and uncertainty. Never forget or take your mind off the fact that I am with you. I am your God and will never leave or forsake you. In the midst of all the chaos and confusion, draw on my limitless strength and refuse to be entangled in the circumstance by leaning on your own understanding and resources. Do not give in to the temptation to be afraid or discouraged. Remember that I have already overcome the world. And because I live in you, you have also overcome the world. The enemy's primary goal is to distract you. He knows that if he can keep you distracted, he can keep you from walking in my will. But I want to assure you that I am here to guide you and protect you. When you feel lost or confused, come to me in prayer. I will show you the way. And when you feel weak and discouraged, I will give you strength. Surrender your weariness to me. Never grow frustrated or impatient with well-doing. Even when things are difficult, don't give up on walking in my simplicity. Those around you may try to tell you that you need to be complex and sophisticated in order to be spiritual. I want to assure you that the opposite is true. Simplicity is your portion. Simplicity is your deliverance. I'm a simple savior with all the answers you need to find yourself in the yoke, easy and the burden light I have set before you. Come as a little child. Let me hold you in my arms. Let me fill you with my love and my peace. And know that I am always with you, no matter what you are facing. The Father says today, make my presence your priority. As you make a determinate and conscious choice to seek the kingdom above every other consideration, I will generously bless your life with the desires of your heart. I have a magnificent plan for you, filled with joy and blessings that might seem like fiction. But it's not it, is the reality of living and breathing and having your life bounded by and surrounded by my glory, power and kingdom strength. I intend to bring you into a state of abundant fulfillment where your deepest desires and dreams become a reality daily. This is the essence of our relationship, my child. I am a loving and caring God who desires to shower you with goodness. Brush aside any religious misconceptions or doubts that may have hindered your belief in my promises. I am a good God and my goodness knows no bounds when it comes to you. Let go of your feeble plans and strategies as they are futile attempts to comprehend how I will bring about the remarkable things I have in store for you. Instead, I urge you to find rest in me. Simply surrender to my care and protection. Let today be characterized by rejoicing and praise, for I assure you, I've got this. No longer should you settle for a mediocre existence. My cherished child, as your eternal shepherd, I have woven days of unparalleled blessing into the fabric of your existence. In the moments when you kneel in prayer, the seeds of your unwavering faith and relentless determination flourish, promising to bear fruit that will drench your soul in tears of happiness and echo through the corridors of time with laughter of joy. Yet, on this sacred journey, you must anchor your heart in the belief that no challenge is insurmountable. Stand firm with a resolve that is steadfast and unshakable, commanding mountains to move, knowing that the celestial realm shall align, unleashing a downpour of divine provision that will satiate your deepest longings and elevate your spirit to new heights. The horizon beckons each day, unfurling like the petals of a new bloom under the golden rays of dawn, whispering the promise of new beginnings, opportunities ripe for the taking, and challenges that will test the metal of your soul. Clad in the armor of faith, march forward, fortified by the Holy Word, with the assurance that I, E, your almighty protector, am ever present. My presence is a beacon in the darkest of nights, a comforting shade in the blaze of noon, a steady hand amidst the fiercest storms, and a gentle caress in the soothing rains. Behold, the days of divine favor are upon you, as declared by your sovereign Lord. To be blessed is to bask in the joy that cascades from the heavens, a divine provision that nourishes your soul and completes your being. It is to stride into every battle, armed with the knowledge that victory is assured, for you are a child of the Most High. Blessedness is found in the simplicity of being content with your daily bread, in the quiet trust you place in me, 
your divine shepherd, who promises to provide not just for your bodily needs, but for the deeper cravings of your soul, the well-being of your family, and the wisdom you seek to nurture your spirit. This wisdom enables you to grow and flourish each day under my guidance, and to be a faithful servant living out the commands of my word with joy and dedication. I declare unto you, days rich with blessing are not merely approaching, they are almost upon us. Let your heart echo with belief in this truth, for you are well acquainted with the reality that the word of your omnipotent Father never falls to the ground unfulfilled. Approach me with all your burdens, let not the weight of these concerns rest upon your shoulders alone. The moment for your peace and rejuvenation has arrived. You expend your energies caring for others, draining yourself. But today, I have drawn near to uplift you, to cradle you in my arms, to offer you solace, and to envelop you in the boundless expanse of my love. Do not forget to cherish your own being as well. It is imperative that you dedicate time to seek me through prayer, to attune your ears to my voice, and to absorb my divine insights. Heed my word and my promises, for I have devised a plan destined to revolutionize your life and that of your families. It is not my desire for you to tread further along a path marked by a wearied soul, a troubled heart, and an encumbered mind. You are not created to endure a lifetime of incessant needs and conflicts. I have liberated and saved you so that you may forever stand tall, free from the shackles of defeat or humiliation at the hands of your adversaries. Into you, I have breathed an immeasurable worth and dignity. This is my solemn promise to you. Now I urge you to embrace my truth with open arms. I am setting before you numerous pathways to embark upon a new journey, leaving the shadows of past errors far behind. Concentrate on your loved ones, on prayer, and on stewarding the abundant blessings that are poised to flood into your life. Imagine awakening each day, liberated from the grips of fear or anxiety, your heart brimming with bravery and joy. Initiate this transformation today. Lift your voice in gratitude and proclaim with unwavering faith. Thank you, my God, for gifting me yet another day of life. Feel the divine strength that encases you from head to toe. Observe as your thoughts and emotions find equilibrium and my words firmly implant within your consciousness. You will retain all that I have imparted to you and it will arm you to face the challenges that today may bring. Recognize and embrace my love for you, accept my peace. Navigate your life with a resolute heart and find solace in my support. Let not the sorrowful whispers of your pillow at night convince you that love has forsaken you. Dismiss such thoughts, for right at this moment, you are enveloped in the tenderness of my divine embrace. The agony you endure is not a marker of your demise, nor a testament to failure. Surrender to me your pain and find solace in my presence. Should tears wish to flow, let them cascade freely. I long to share in every tear, to be with you in your moments of sorrow, standing by your side. I empathize deeply with your suffering, and it grieves me too. Yet know this, we are united in this trial, and as the dawn breaks with the sun of faith, illuminating your morning, the warmth of my love, your heavenly Father's love, will still be right there beside you. I am here to offer comfort, to imbue you with strength, and to reaffirm how immensely precious you are to me. Ask yourself, what force on earth or in the heavens can ever detach you from my embrace? Let this truth sink into the very core of your being. No anguish, no persecution, doubts, nor trials have the power to sever you from my steadfast, eternal, boundless, and sincere love. I impart this to you so that you might always bear in mind that regardless of your shortcomings and errors, my love for you stands unshakable. I do not falter, I do not deceive, nor do I embellish. If I have professed my love for you a million times over, it is because my love for you is beyond measure, beyond time, infinitely vast and unfailing. Remember, my child, as it is written in Romans 8, 38-39, for I am convinced that neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, neither the present nor the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, 
nor anything else in all creation will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. Let this be a testament to the enduring nature of my love for you, a love that transcends all barriers, a beacon of hope, and a source of strength, no matter the circumstances. The moment has arrived for you to fully embrace the depths of my love, discarding every ounce of doubt that shadows your heart. Let your faith be unyielding, akin to a sturdy sailboat that bravely traverses through stormy seas and fierce winds. You are destined neither to sink nor to be lost in the abyss, nor to stumble in your journey. Trust in my words, grasp the magnitude of this truth. It is time to stand firm in faith, to rise from despair, to walk in unwavering confidence. My hand has showered numerous blessings upon you, each a testament to my unfailing providence. Offer me your heart with the utmost trust and never allow your faith to be shaken. I assure you, I will never forsake you. Proclaim your belief in me. Experience the warmth of my constant presence. Allow this assurance to guide you, as it is affirmed in Hebrews 13, 5, I will never leave you nor forsake you. Thus, with such a promise, let your heart be fortified. I call upon you to stand strong amidst the tempest, secure in the knowledge that your anchor is cast in the bedrock of my love and faithfulness. Your path is illuminated by the light of my word, a beacon that guides you through the darkest nights and the fiercest storms. Embrace this journey with me, knowing that my love envelops you like a shield, protecting and guiding you towards a destiny filled with hope and abundance. With each step you take, remember, my promises are true, and my love is ceaseless. Let your heart be filled with the peace that comes from knowing you are never alone, for I am with you guiding your steps, lifting you above the tumult of the waves, and leading you to shores of peace and prosperity. Trust in me with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways, submit to me, and I will make your path straight. As proclaimed in Proverbs 3, 5, 6, This is the faith I call you to a faith that sees beyond the visible, that reaches into the very heart of the divine where my love for you is endless and my commitment to your well-being is unwavering. I am ever-present, eagerly awaiting your conversations with me. Your mind brims with ambitions and well-laid plans. You embody diligence and responsibility. Harbor no fear, for your path is aligned with triumph in and trust in me without reservation. Seek my presence daily and attentively. Embrace the wisdom my words impart. My desire is for you to tread confidently, to anchor your dreams in the unshakable foundation of the rock, and to lay down the roots of your family's future in alignment with my will and guidance. I am certain you grasp the essence of my message. My request is simple, direct your focus towards what truly matters, ensuring your precious time and energies are not wasted on ephemeral pursuits and trivial distractions. Your relationship with me is paramount, let us remain inseparably connected. I await those quiet moments of your attentive listening, for it is in those silences that our deepest exchanges unfold. Your growth and fortification fill me with immense joy, especially as I observe the dreams you chase and the dedication you pour into them. My intent is to shower you with blessings so profound that doubt finds no foothold, for you have been precisely placed in this moment perfectly prepared for the openings I am about to reveal to you. Proceed. Approach each opportunity with courage. A realm of blessings beckons the courageous, the ones who recognize their value, who reject the echoes of negativity and the discourse of failure or surrender. Embrace this journey with the assurance that you are not alone. Each step you take is a step closer to the fruition of your dreams. Under my watchful eye, and with my guiding hand. The adversities you encounter are not roadblocks, but stepping stones, meticulously placed by me to elevate you to greater heights. In the face of difficulty, remember that resilience and faith open the gates to untold blessings. Stand firm in your worth, undeterred by fear or discouragement, for in my promise lies your victory and fulfillment. I have intricately woven you into existence, infuse life within your very being, 
and graced you with a splendid dominion. Yet should you find yourself retreating in hesitation, shackled by doubts of my assurances or swayed by the errant counsel of those who do not know me, we stand at a crossroads for your growth and flourishing. An unwavering faith in me is essential. You must anchor your belief in the truth that I harbor an unfathomable love for you, that my presence is a steadfast reality, and that it is within my greatest desires to nurture and shower blessings upon you. Your existence, your prosperity, rest securely within my omnipotent hands. Trust in this without reservation. Affirm your faith in me. Step into the sanctity of my embrace. Allow my touch to mend your heart and pacify your spirit. As dawn breaks, my intention is to erase the remnants of nocturnal sorrows, to infuse your being with a joy that radiates as you venture into the daylight. You have spent countless hours in the silence of the night, wrestling with concerns that stretch beyond your reach. Let me be your ally. Grant me the privilege to fortify our bond, to enrich this divine companionship. While I value your reverence, I yearn for your trust, to see me not only as your God, but also as your confidant. Share with me your burdens. I am ever present to listen. Your confessions are safe with me, shielded from every ear. I promise forgiveness and to hurl your transgressions into the abyss. As I have proclaimed, your previous errors are not for me to brandish. I choose not to dwell on what lies behind us. Thus, I invite you to dedicate moments each day for our dialogue. I will attentively absorb your words, consider your pleas, and commence the orchestration of my responses. Faith is all that is required of you, along with a measure of patience, for the realization of my vows will encounter no delay. The blessings you seek, the answers you yearn for, will assuredly find their way to you in due course. I encourage you to embrace tranquility in this moment, positioning yourself in readiness for the influx of blessings poised on the horizon. Sustenance, serenity, robust health, spiritual wealth, extraordinary prosperity, familial harmony, restoration within your household, forgiveness and tender affection, these await you. As dawn breaks, ushering in the gift of a new day, let your heart swell with appreciation for this blessing, this privilege you've been granted. Consider those in the throes of hardship who equally yearn for my intervention. I am appointing you, as my emissary, to embody my love and disseminate the essence and splendor of my divine scheme. Witness the expansion of your joy and the fortification of your vigor as you cultivate a demeanor of worship and thankfulness. My deepest desire is for your happiness. In this assertion, there is no falsehood. Yet the onus is yours to accord me the reverence I am due in your life to heed my guidance and to earnestly seek my presence. It brings me joy to shower you with blessings and envelop you in my love, regardless of the complexities encircling your circumstances. In moments of despair, find solace beneath the shelter of my wings. When anxiety besieges you, find comfort upon my shoulder and unburden your soul. Entrust me with all your fears and apprehensions, for my grace and mercy know no bounds. Let this assurance fill you, my readiness to bestow upon you and your loved ones, a life marked by peace, health, spiritual growth, and abundance is unwavering. Start each day with a heart brimming with gratitude, recognizing the sheer beauty and opportunity each morning brings. Your role as a beacon of my love in the lives of those enduring suffering is critical. Through you, the radiance of my love and the grandeur of my intentions will be manifested. As you embrace a lifestyle of gratitude and praise, you'll find your happiness augmented and your resilience strengthened. Remember, my desire for your joy is unfeigned, rooted in the very essence of my being. However, your fulfillment and the realization of these blessings hinge upon your willingness to prioritize me in your life, to adhere to my teachings, and to pursue me with zeal. I revel in the opportunity to bless and cherish you, even amidst the trials you may face. When the weight of the world feels unbearable, retreat to the refugee provided by my embrace. Share your concerns with me and let my boundless grace and mercy carry you through. My love for you 
is profound and unwavering, and it is because of this deep affection that I am committed to supporting you. You are cherished deeply by me, my child, and there should never be any room for doubt regarding this truth. You have opened your heart wide to me, embraced my essence with all your might, and your devotion fills me with immense joy. It is for this very reason that you are entitled to approach me boldly, with confidence, communicating with me openly, with clarity, and devoid of any apprehension. Understand that you are worthy of guidance and correction when necessary. I have brought you into existence, having chosen you even before you took your first breath in this world. I am intimately familiar with every aspect of your being, your battles, your strengths, your aspirations, and your vulnerabilities. When you falter and fall, know that it does not provoke my wrath. Never hesitate to seek my presence, even when burdened with guilt. Where else shall you turn? To those who profess their regard and affection for you, only to betray my teachings and speak negatively of you behind your back. The sanctuary you yearn for a haven of friendship, understanding, and boundless love can only be found in my presence. I'm here not to judge harshly, but to offer refuge and redemption. In my eyes, you are more than your mistakes. You are a beloved creation deserving of grace and a fresh start. Let my love be the foundation on which you rebuild and renew your spirit. Together, we will navigate the complexities of life, drawing strength from our unbreakable bond. Remember, my arms are always open, ready to offer comfort, guidance, and the unconditional love that you seek. Come to me and let us walk this journey together, enveloped in the light of my love and the promise of a future filled with hope and fulfillment. My pursuit is not to catalogue your errors, for I am already acquainted with each one. It is not my desire to witness your faltering, only to turn away in disdain. Rather, in moments when you find yourself drifting away from my embrace, it is I who venture forth to meet you, to gently guide you back to the sanctuary of peace. Within this haven flows the river of serenity, from which you may quench your thirst with its revitalizing waters. This is the earnest plea I extend to you once more. Never allow the shadow of your most challenging trials to make you forget the depth of my love for you. My affection, coupled with my omnipotence, stands ready to extricate you from the depths of despondency, to infuse your being with a renewed sense of purpose and fulfillment, and to rekindle the bravery and zest for life that seem beyond your grasp. My deepest wish is for you to trust in me, to immerse yourself in the realization that you are profoundly loved and safeguarded. For this is the eternal truth, unchanging across the ages. Let this assurance be your stronghold, reminiscent of the promises found within the scriptures, such as Isaiah 43, 2, which proclaims, when you pass through the waters, I will be with you, when when you pass through the rivers, they will not sweep over you, this passage is a testament to the steadfast nature of my love and protection over your life. My presence is a constant, unwavering force designed to guide you through every trial and tribulation, offering a wellspring of hope and renewal when despair seems to have the upper hand. Embrace this truth with all your heart, knowing that my love is a beacon that shines brightly, guiding you back to me time and time again. In me, you will find the solace and strength necessary to face whatever lies ahead. Assured of my eternal love and commitment to your well-being, I want to assure you of my everlasting love, a love that seeks your highest good now and forevermore. Rest assured, I am vigilantly overseeing the well-being of your family. Continue to lift them up in prayer, for they rest securely within my providential care. Your prayers serve as a powerful conduit through which I am actively intervening in their lives, addressing even those concerns that remain invisible to your eyes. Do not halt your supplications. Their need for your spiritual intercession is profound. Know that I accompany each of them as they step out from the safety of your home, safeguarding them from harm and enveloping them in my protection. Embrace tranquility, my dear child, for I am orchestrating the unity and peace of your household. The distress and sorrow that weigh upon you are on the verge of transformation. Together, 
You and your family will experience a deepening bond. I am in the process of distancing those who sow discord and ill will from your midst. However, it is imperative that you extend forgiveness and show compassion towards each of them. Refrain from engaging with their antagonism and you will witness a cessation of their disruptive actions. Let this assurance inspire you. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called children of God. Matthew 5, 9 As you embody peace and forgiveness, you become a reflection of my kingdom on earth, influencing not only your family, but also those around you. Your restraint and love, in the face of provocation, are powerful testimonies of your faith and trust in my will. Therefore, persist in prayer, remain steadfast in love, and continue to foster forgiveness. In doing so, you align with my purposes, becoming a vessel through which my grace and healing can flow into the lives of your loved ones and even your adversaries. The unity and harmony you long for within your home are being woven together by my hand. Stand firm in this faith and prepare to witness the beautiful unfolding of my plan for you and your family. You were brought into existence with a divine purpose to embody and disseminate my love, to be a beacon of my kindness and illumination in the world. It is through the living testimony of your life that many within your circle, especially your family, will undergo transformation. They will observe the serenity and profound change in you and start to question the source of your peace and newfound demeanor. It is in these moments of curiosity and wonder that you must attribute the transformation to your faith in me, asserting that just as I have reshaped your life, I hold the capacity to transform the lives of each member of your family as well. Continue to intercede for them in prayer, my beloved child. While it may seem beyond your ability to alter certain circumstances or to be perpetually by their side, remember, my reach knows no bounds. I will intervene on your behalf and theirs because of my boundless love for every soul upon this earth. Your role in this divine partnership is simple yet profound. Commit to prayer, relinquish all forms of resentment, malicious talk, envy and bitterness. Place your unwavering trust in me, live with the assurance that I oversee all and that my timing is impeccable. Surrender your worries to me and you shall witness remarkable transformations in your surroundings. If doubts ever cloud your mind about my ability to reach someone within your home, cling to faith, for my power knows no limits. I'm capable of altering mindsets, reshaping character, and softening hearts. Be patient, for soon you will bear witness to the evidence of my transformative power. Remember with man, this is impossible, but with God, all things are possible. Let this assurance fortify your faith and guide your actions as you walk in obedience and submission to my will. You pave the way for miracles to unfold, not only in your life, but in the lives of those around you. Stand firm in this belief and ready your heart for the wondrous works I am about to perform in your midst. Brace yourself for what I am about to unveil will surpass your wildest expectations. I want you to know that my presence will surround you both by day and by night guiding the unfolding of events in alignment with my celestial scheme. Turn to the scriptures and commune with me in heartfelt prayer, for it is through these sacred texts that I will affirm the veracity of my promises to you. Though heaven and earth may vanish, my words will stand unalterable and eternal. I will navigate you, leading you directly to the juncture of your breakthrough, to the very spot where you will thrive unboundedly. Anticipate a profound metamorphosis within your life as my plans for you come to fruition. Embrace the gift I am extending to you. You are on the verge of entering a realm that marks the beginning of all your dreams and ambitions. In this new phase, you will cross paths with souls whose journeys mirror your own, whose thoughts resonate with the echoes of your aspirations. Together, you will craft a tapestry of blessings and wonders. For the scope of what I have in store for you is beyond your wildest imaginations. Approach every individual with kindness and empathy, for you are destined to meet people of virtue and extraordinary character. Souls who will captivate and inspire you, help will arrive from quarters you least expect. Remain vigilant with your senses, 
finely tuned so that when the moment arrives and the door to new possibilities opens wide, you will not be ensnared in trivial pursuits or meaningless distractions. Further explanations are unnecessary. My message to you is unambiguous and its truth resonates within you. You know with certainty that I will direct your footsteps and remain by your side through every season of life. Place your trust in me, for my love for you is boundless. Today, I aim to show you the depth of your significance to me. I am the guardian of your heart, the provider of tranquility to your mind and the purifier of your thoughts. In moments of upheaval, know that I am steadfastly by your side. Believe in the assurance I bring. This message is a treasure meant just for you. Every blessing you receive flows from my grace and with me is your constant companion. Each new day unfolds as an opportunity for unexpected joys and divine interventions. I am here to empower you to be your beacon of hope in the darkest nights and through the most challenging trials. My love for you is the foundation of my commitment to alleviate your worries. It is out of this profound love that I assure you of my forgiveness. Should there have been moments when you felt distant or if doubts about my presence clouded your heart, know that I forgive your hesitation and every misstep along the way. My ultimate wish is to breathe new life into your being, to catalyze a transformation within you that enables you to walk in step with me, fully embracing the life I have envisioned for you. I admire your dedication to those you hold dear, yet I urge you to lift them up in your prayers as well. Rest assured, I extend my vigilant watch over you and your loved ones at all times. Through every journey you undertake, under the brilliance of day and through the shadows of night, across paths blessed and even those misguided, continue to pray. Maintain your trust in me and let not anxiety overwhelm you. I pledge to safeguard them, harboring the same desire to welcome them back into my embrace, should they stray in search of new horizons. Have you forgotten, or perhaps it momentarily escaped your memory, the reason behind my sacrifice, enduring the agony of the cross? It was to envelop you and your loved ones in my boundless mercy. My desire is for you to approach my throne with confidence at any time. The gateway is perpetually open. My ear is inclined towards you, and my promises stand ready to manifest in your life. Nurturing your faith and yielding a harvest that paves the way to a more fulfilling existence. Let me affirm once again, for the sake of absolute clarity, that your unwavering faith and trust in me are what I seek. There's no need for prolonged contemplation. Should you face any challenge, simply come before me and trust me with your concerns. And that is sufficient. I will heed your call and my word, alive and powerful, will manifest its truth in your life. This same word that you engage with daily through reading, listening and earnest reflection carries beautiful promises that echo in your thoughts amidst trials. When you feel assailed, wounded or diminished by the words or actions of others, remember my commitment to never leave you forsaken. I will never leave you nor forsake you. I want you to know, without a shadow of a doubt, that your life and the lives of your family are securely held within my hands. No one can remove you from my care. My love's magnitude has been revealed through countless gestures and the time for doubt has passed. You and your family hold immeasurable value in my eyes. Do not lose heart or refrain from praying. This message comes in response to your plea for a sign and here it stands. Should you require further assurance, know that I am ever willing to communicate with you. Awaken your senses, ready your heart, for I find joy in speaking with you and yearn to reveal the depths of my love continually. I am ever attentive to your voice, never growing weary of hearing your petitions. Yet, I urge you to persist in prayer. Do not regard it as a fruitless endeavor, exercise patience, and allow me the grace to work intricately in your life. I promise to deliver beyond your expectations when the moment for my answer arrives. Do not lose heart in your period of waiting. Engage in introspection. Consider how you have cultivated and fortified your faith. It has grown more resilient and unwavering. You find yourself less daunted 
by challenges and less consumed by fear. In the face of conflict, you are walking my path. And this is commendable. In those trying times when you felt adrift, you did not veer off course or wander down convoluted and hazardous byways. Rather, you clung steadfastly to my love. And this brings me immense joy. Take comfort in the assurance that I am always attuned to your prayers, committed to answering them. Your journey of faith demonstrates a remarkable transformation. You've learned to stand firm, drawing closer to me with each step. This steadfastness is a testament to the strength of our bond, a bond that will never be broken. I celebrate your devotion and the progress you've made on this spiritual voyage. Your trust in me, even amidst uncertainty, is a profound act of worship that does not go unnoticed.